The announcement made by the Sangha Sabha at the Askari Temple yesterday was raised at the Cabinet Media Briefing today. We have acted in accordance to the law. The law is enforced on all, no matter which religion one belongs to or who the monk or priest is. The government is looking into the announcement made by the Sangha Sabha. A response will be made in due course. <laughs> The respective institutions are looking into how one can act while protecting the dignity of the monks. That is why disciplinary committees have been created. The statement does not mention anything like that. I witnessed the statement made by the Sangha Sabha. The Sangha Sabha says one thing and the Mahanayaka says another. As a responsible government, we will act on all that is reported. The Department of Archaeology has complete authority to take action if damage or harm is caused to any artifact with archaeological importance. If they join with the department and the Sri Lanka police, any action could be taken. 21 incidents have been reported in relation to the breach of reconciliation between communities. All 21 incidents are being looked into. These complaints include those against Venerable Yana Saratero, Minister Vishad Badiuddin, as well as against Provincial Councillor Sivaj Lingam. They are being examined.